Hello, I'm Tom, and today for dinner I'm cooking myself salmon. Not using an oven or a hob or anything conventional, today I'm going to be using the cooking power of this. An everyday household dishwasher. The idea of poaching salmon in a dishwasher has been around for a long time. Bob Bloomer, the surreal gourmet, claims to have poached salmon in more than a hundred dishwashers on three continents. An actor and gourmet cook, Vincent Price, is said to have once cooked it on Johnny Carson's Tonight Show. But there's no video evidence of it online yet, so I figured it was worth a try. Provided you wrap the fish really tightly in aluminium foil, there's no real danger to the dishwasher. I say that mainly because it's my landlord's dishwasher, and they'll probably end up watching this at some point. I drizzled a little oil, added the salmon, and then spent two minutes carefully folding and pressing the aluminium foil to make sure it was airtight. I had to be certain no water and detergent could get in, and that no salmon could get out. And then, I put the package in the dishwasher, added a capsule of detergent, set it to a normal cycle, and turned it on. And now, I wait. I checked inside occasionally, just in case there was some kind of salmon-based explosion. Half an hour in, everything looks good. The foil's still in one piece and there's no salmon thrown about the dishwasher, so I think it's okay. Finally, it was time for the moment of truth. Oh, okay, Steve. Ooh. After I defogged my glasses, I removed the salmon. It was hot. Ha, ooh, ah. Carefully, I unwrapped the package. It was dry inside, nothing seemed to have leaked. Nothing smelled fishy from the outside. But I didn't know what I'd find. Salmon ruined by detergent? Raw fish that was just a bit warm around the edges? Or possibly, just possibly, Oh, look at that. It seemed perfect. It flaked into two pieces as I moved it to a plate, but that just showed that it was light pink all the way through and cooked thoroughly. So here's the big question. How does it taste? Perfect. I do be